Welcome back to Let's Play The Legend of Dragoon. In the last episode, we traveled from the city of, um, or the tower of, uh, Flanvel to snow, or through the snowy field, um, and we are basically going through snowy field, uh, to Velweb. So, I am actually going to save real quick. Okay, just making sure that everything's cool and kosher. So yeah, um, I ended up getting, or um, I should say, Wonderbread ended up giving me a um, wired 360 controller that I mapped to the um, uh, PlayStation emulator. So now I'm using a actual controller instead of the keyboard, so you won't hear me clanking on the keys anymore. Uh, we are here in the capital city of Aleb. The Seven Towers. Is Diaz, Diaz waiting for us somewhere in there? That is the Tower of the Seven Dragoons. The throne of the Holy Emperor Hem Holy Emperor is underneath there. We are standing at the legendary place where humans began their liberation. I wonder if it's an abominable place as well. You think too much. It's the same as Cad uh, Cadicia, isn't it? When you drag it drag the pass around you can't walk anymore it's true Maru, the forbidden land that was the royal capital of the winglings and this vel web is a mere historical ruin. ruin yes we cannot do nothing but settle for the present all right so that sounds good so nothing hidden uh, there is a, um, alright, so, yeah, uh, I don't remember what I was saying before I got, you know, interrupted, so, oh yeah, there is a, um, freaking, so, as I try to say it one more time, there is a Stardust here in the web. Of course we can't freaking, uh, we just, it always happens where we can't, um, carry enough items. So we're just going to use the healing fog. I know it's kind of a waste, you might think. Uh, but there is a uh, fucking attack ball. Um, <clears throat> those two guys right there sell us um, items. Don't know why the hell I couldn't think about it. Think of what it was, but yeah, they sell us items. And hopefully we can get to them before the next battle. Brother, there are no customers here. Um, I'm not doubting your word, though. Don't worry. Believe me, there are always customers, even in a place, kind of place like this. Okay, I believe you, brother. You're right, brother. There really are, uh, they are really customers. It's all due to the skills of my passionate merchant soul. You learn, uh, you have to learn from this. I sell weapons, and I sell items. We are peddlers. It must be fated that we would meet here. Why don't you buy some shit? Okay, we'll buy some shit. All right, so damn battles are always popping up. I swear the random the random encounter rate in this game is just too freaking too high. All right, so let's see here. What are we going to do? Uh, well, of course we're gonna buy the energy girdle, which is kind of gay. Think about it. Um, we're gonna, yeah, we're gonna buy two giganto rings too. Uh, one for dart and or wait, should we buy one for dart? Uh, okay, we'll just buy one for now. Let's look at the. Uh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we already found your brother and your sister. I think they're actually both. Brothers. But I'm not 100% sure, so... Um, armed... Oh, so we have an attack badge? So wait, why would... Okay, so I'm gonna go over to the Giganto ring, put a panic ring on just to see. Um... 
so the Giganto Ring would raise our defense even higher, which we wouldn't really need, so we might as well leave that one. But for, um, for Hassle, it would, anything would lower his magic defense, or his magic attack, yeah, his magic, yeah, his magic attack. But this would bring up his, uh, base attack a little bit. So, yeah, we're gonna buy that. Um, and then I'll sell what we got for the, uh, um, like his stuff real quick. So, we'll sell, should we sell that one too? Okay, why not? And we're gonna sell some items too, no. Sell some items. I don't want these damn attack balls. So we're going to buy another Giganto Ring and we're going to put that on Congo. Yeah, yeah, we know, we know, we know. Okay, we get it. We understand. Buy items from this cocksucker. Alright. So, Healing Breeze. I don't like doing the all. I'd rather just keep it where I have... Um, just for one of them. It's more convenient that way. Because I don't want to heal somebody if they don't need it. So, I don't know. It's just easier that way for me. Alright, so... I'm over here for a little bit more cinematic scenes. Dart, look at the huge battery. Is that a battery? It doesn't look like a battery to me. Or maybe she didn't say battery. Human shot, huge air from, from there, aiming it at the Tower of Franville. And back then, humans threw this way. What? That arrow would not only shear the darkness that covers the earth, but also shear their corruption, corrupted hearts, which were accustomed to being ruled. Why are you suddenly starting to say this? I don't know, I still can't tell. But if we meet the guy who claims he is Diaz, I think we will find out the reason. I am speaking nonsense again, let's keep going. A hero of history is waiting for us. Okay, so I guess this isn't really a thing. Just kind of walk down this way. And kind of walk this way. Then get into yet another fucking battle. Oh, okay, so what the hell? Oh, please tell me this isn't a boss battle. Oh, it's Shirley. I've been waiting for you. You are Shirley? Why? Why are you here? You ascended to heaven, I thought. Before that, I had something I had to take care of on. Take care of here in Bell Web. I couldn't uh, leave the trapped souls alone in this world. Are you talking about? Yes, the four souls of the dragoons who lost their lives during the dragon campaign. Their souls were drawn to Mayfield, the gate of Inferno from which you can never return is requesting the souls of the dragoons. The death setting Mayfield? I thought it was destroyed. I don't know how, but it is true that the gate from the Inferno is open again. Rose, I made their souls inert and anchored them to anchored them in this place, but the, there is the limit of my power. After you meet Diaz, please visit this, visit this place again and lead their souls to heaven. I think I can do that. The souls of the dragoons are wandering somewhere in the towers. But we have to take care of something else now. Let's go find Diaz. So that is like a hint that we come back to this place. Um, I forgot to mention that uh, Hassel did level up. I don't know why I forgot to mention it, but I did. And we are going to save. Save, 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 save. Because I don't want to lose any progress. And I actually don't know whether or not... Um, Whether or not now is basically when you go to a boss battle or anything like that. 
But that is going to be it for this episode of Let's Play The Legend of Dragon. Please stay tuned next time to see us uh, head through Velweb and find Diaz. I will see you guys in the next one.